right. We are back, and we are swimming. Stay close to the surface, because I really don't know how long you can hold your breath in this game. Uh, up. Anything useful in the pilot house? You're dead. Oh, but you have a safe. Damn it. What will I find in the captain's strong box, I wonder? Nice. Not really much of anything. Super. Alright, well. It looks like. Huh weird design for a tugboat. Alright, so... Where's that thing? There it is. What am I looking at here? Oh! Oh. Oh. It's... It's <laughs> right. well, That's perfect. Submerged and B must have been all the way up the sail because I am pretty far down and I probably would have flooded out this entire area. All right, what do we got? Hello? Oh, I watched you talk to a boy on the dock. Swim out here. Yeah, a but not a threat. No. Come in, Hopian. Um, uh, peace? <laughs> Who are you? Who are you? Zhao, captain of the Chinese Navy. I sail the Yangtze 31. This champion. Uh, this submarine. My beautiful boat. Speak harsh words of me if you must. But my Yangtze. Speak of her with respect. Why are you here? War is over. If I called her a garbage scow, would we get into a fight oh, with a whole bunch of Klingons? And my Yangtze holds no bow, no treasure, nothing for you to plunder. Uh. I could die Kami, you. Because <coughs> you did kind of blow up my city and lead to the events which cost me my wife and kid. But, it's been 200 years, water under the bridge. How long have you been waiting? Have you been here for 200 years? Ah, it has been that long. Should, uh, yes, I suppose it has. Long ago, just after the fire, Yangtze struck a mine. My Chen Tian Barely made it here into harbor. City already in ruins by then. Few noticed us. Fewer cared. Too much Tongku. Your arrival is good Xing Yun for me. I need help, you see. Yangtze is not. Is she worthy? You will help me fix her? Uh. <laughs> Why would you trust me? Why would you trust me? A stranger. Trust is risk. But a man must plow with oxen he has. You are not like raiders that board my Chen Ting. Mm. My young So I'm cattle you to you? show peace. Xie Xie. And what do you plan to do with the sub? Will you nuke things? Or just drive away? What will you do with the submarine once it's fixed? I sail for Zhongguo, return to China, where I belong. My jia, my home. Uh, to rebuild their military machine and 
come back and wipe us out for good? What will you do there? Anything Zhao can do. If China is gone, I will build house by house. And if no houses can be built, I will die. My Jia at peace. Uh, hmm. You know what? I'm curious to see what happens when the sub gets up and going. And then maybe we can go, like, fishing? Deep sea? Huh? I'm at your disposal. Ha! <laughs> yes! Thank you! Yes, yeah, my friend. But, first problem. Yangzi has uh, no power. Of course it doesn't. If we get reactor working, probably enough. There is damage to a... Uh, a dampening coil. Bad damage. Oh, wait a Need second. A new coil. <laughs> I have information. The intelligence of Fun Wartime. Dampening coils are at the facility of the Saugus Ironworks. Really? Perhaps these will help. I already have the dampening coil from Saugus. <sighs> Fortune favors us both, it seems. Now all we need... Well, when at least when I pick up things like that, there's a sound to tell me that I've completed a quest. What type of fuel? Where are you going to get that? Ah, now that is the right question to ask. Two hundred years ago, I launched all of Yangtze's high-yield nuclear missiles, as ordered. For two hundred years, I have lived with that guilt, that shame. So much fire, such bay, but one missile failed to launch. N no. You must go down. Remove Dude, the you're wire. the one who can survive bathed in radiation. To me. Yeah, why not why you? Don't you get it. Ah, because I have different task. Oh, you are getting warhead. I will prepare the reactor. But the reactor's but cold. No, I must. If the reactor's cold, it's you. safer for me. There is danger. We shall. Old crew, still down there. Not yeah, okay like their of captain. They are. Worse. They do not harm me. But they will kill you. No, I, they won't. I cannot kill them. Still, they are my crew. My family. Jaren. All of us. But you must do what you must do. So I'm basically your tool to avoid a guilty conscience for killing the crew that you should have put down a long time ago because they're fucking ghouls? Are you serious? Ah. It's almost enough of an asshole thing to make me want to shoot him. This belongs in the garbage can, yes? No, it doesn't. It's a fuse. You use fuses. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be short with you. I'm a little grumpy because I'm being sent to kill a whole bunch of ghouls. Um, apparently just because. <clears throat> Although I will take your sword, sir. Yeah, we'll call that a fair trade. Soap. I suspect that you won't be needing it, since you are a terrifying skinless monster. Alright. Wait, is that a diagram? That is a weird looking sub. I mean, kind of cool, but... Weird. Alright. Anything in here? Uh, okay. Which way do we go? Oh. Don't watch.
wonder if I should loot everything that I can right now, because as soon as he fixes the boat, he's going to sail away, right? Hello? Oh, man. <clears throat> Hello? Anyone? Oh. Movement. These aren't smart ghouls, are they? You gonna stay away from me until I'm... Yep! Dead! Um, hello? Hello? Whoa! <laughs> Oh. Uh. Awesome. That was a legendary crewman that didn't actually register as, or didn't note itself as legendary. Perfect. Don't look at me with those dead yellow eyes. All right. What am I doing down here? Zombies. And zombies on a submarine is so much worse than just zombies out in the world. Because you can't get away from them. This is like... Ugh, this is like system shock. Only terrible. At least they're not calling me, you know, weak creature of flesh and bone, or whatever the hell it was that... Ooh. Oh boy. Hello. Uh, right? there be a vault tech lunchbox aboard a Chinese sub? Unless... Was vault tech in league with the Chinese and orchestrated the nuclear apocalypse in order both to validate their... their own reason for existing as well as 
provide the catalyst for beginning all of their vault experiments? Hmm. I mean, no, it's not the only possible reason, but it's no less plausible than anything else I've seen. Oh, boy. a little bit too conspiracy theory. Mm. Sorry. Got Does it. that make me too a little bit too conspiracy theory loving to even suggest something like that? Or <clears throat> given Voltec's relative scumminess, does it make perfect sense? I think. A sequin dress! I think that it makes perfect sense. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Well, for a communist ship, these guys certainly have a lot of trappings of. Capitalism about them. Let's just continue on. Whoa. Soap. Medical terminal. This is the med bay, right? I saw... Quite certain that I saw an IV stand next to that, uh, bed. Maybe? Jesus, these are big words. Nice. Ah, ship's armory. Good. Although nothing in here really stands out. Oh, what was 
that, three or five mini nukes? That stands out. That was worthwhile, although I still have... Whoa, whoa. Oh, boy. Hello. Oh, here. You are totally in the way, Kiri. Totally in the way. Get back, get back, get back. There we go. Let's just take this leg out. Let's just take this leg out. Hello. Oh. First mate, sir. You appear to have a uh, piece of texture connecting your back to your ankle. Thought you, uh, thought you might want to know. Ugh. I have a submariner's hat, though, which is awesome. Alright. Am I going to have to re up my Radex soon? I think so. Oh. Oh, yeah. Warhead. And I'm being irradiated. Let's see, back through here. Oh, first mate. Alright. Let's go. Let's continue on. Because it is very, very hot in here. your stuff, man. Where are you? Hello. Here is the warhead. No difficulty with the warhead, I trust. Oh, no, not at all. However, uh, there were other missiles down there, apparently. Not that I necessarily saw them, but I do have the dialogue option. What the hell are you going to do with those? What are you going to do with the other missiles? Nothing. That is what. No plans. They are small, tactical, of no real use. Yeah, but you've already lied now, to me about only one of them not going do. off. Head down to the reactor. Take dampening coil and warhead with you. First, insert the dampening coil. Carefully. Xiaoxin. Then, sure. put warhead into the reactor. As you do that, I monitor power levels from the control room. Do okay. not put warhead in first. Do that? Si Wang. Death for you and me both. Uh you're talking nuclear detonation? Hmm. Alright. So dampening rods first, huh? I will install the dampening coil. And then I will install the warhead. A little bit concerned that your reactor design actually accepts a nuclear warhead as a uh, standard fuel. Captain Zhao. Was not sure my beautiful young would hold together. Oh, great. Now but you tell me. You did it. You are a capitalist. I know you expect payment for services. Instead, I would offer you service in exchange for your service. It is our way. Take these. Uh, Transponders. Each one mm -hmm. acts as a homing signal for a missile <laughs> I can fire from my young Only small, tactical news. But you should still get as far away as possible. Throw transponder <laughs> like a grenade to activate. Oh. Then wait for Bao Kabu. Oh, jeez. So, uh... Why the gift? Why would you let me use up your missiles? I have no wish to bring weapons back home. 
I leave the fire here, and hmm. I owe you. Zhao pays his debt. Besides, my missiles just might save your bacon. Soon I will set sail. You should get ashore. Farewell, American. I must admit, I have met worse capitalists. Wow. Um, so on the one hand, that's kind of a nice altruistic thing. Uh, handing me the homing beacons for his missiles. The flip side of that, though, is that, again, I'm sort of... I'm sort of forced into the position of uh, potentially putting homing beacons down around Boston and allowing the Chinese to nuke it again. It should be sitting less well with me than it is. Flip side of that, it is Boston. There was no magazine or anything aboard. Well, all right. You know what? We'll go back to Sanctuary. Oh, wait, no. Talk to the kid. Tell him what his sea monster really was. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Where is he? I'm lost in the fog. There he is. That's him. I'm lost in the fog, and I'm terribly, terribly irradiated right now. Um... I didn't hear anything. Probably crispy enough that my penis is smoking like a lit cigar. Uh, nope. Mmm. I'll play along. It swallowed me. I used a knife to cut its heart out. Whoa, that's so cool. Yes. I wish I could have watched. You can't see it very well from here. Well, thanks for killing it, I guess. You're welcome. Donnie. You're still alive! I guess it wasn't dangerous. Well... You know, the blood dripping from every orifice in my body right now would say otherwise. Hold on. Let me just clear that up. I'd like to take your mouth and take care of all of You're it. You're still right. alive! I guess it wasn't dangerous. Alright. You're... a little bit crazy, kid. I'm going home. That's that's what I'm doing. And if the sub is still around at some point later, I'm going to loot the shit out of it because there was a whole lot of good salvage down there. So that's it. Uh, that was the Yangtze. Yangtze. However you pronounce it. And I guess we'll continue clearing quests next time.